So here we are in deep outer space. I want to show you now the scientific sources from NASA supporting the amazing anti-aging benefits of this very powerful sleep machine. So first of all, what I am going to do is take you to the actual site in NASA where there is the source material. We go over here and we come to this site here. Now it might be hard for you to see that address there, but if you want to check it out yourself, here it is so you can see it very easily. Now I also have my sites here that have links to a lot more research that backs up the exceptional power of this anti-aging sleep machine. At sleepmachine.info, at helpsheal.com, and really at sleepaid.biz, there's a lot of other sleep aids that aren't related, and that's a site that's just partially developed. So there's your information right there. Now one of the things I want to point out on this paper here from NASA is what powerful effects it had on the cells. This is at the 10 hertz square wave frequency which is a golden bell compared to all the other frequencies. And of course this device known as the Earth Pulse Sleep on Command has frequencies from 0.6 all the way up to 14.1. These frequencies are all known as very healthy frequencies. Frequencies from 15 Hertz and on do have damaging side effects. That's been shown by many tests done by the Russians and, and by NASA and others. But the golden bell that has such powerful anti-aging health benefits is at the 10 Hertz frequency. Now the device that I am talking about here, the Earth Pulse Sleep on Command, has a very low price compared to most PEMF devices, that is pulsed electromagnetic field devices that are used to repair bones and many other, and help in many other areas in health. Now I'm not gonna get into all of that here, I just wanna give you the source information. So I'm gonna go to find here, and I'm gonna type into here the 175 maturation genes, that is genes that cause aging that were turned off and also the 150 genes towards a younger more youthful cell uh, that were turned on so when I hit this enter here I'm gonna have to skip down a few to get to the right source material but we will get there this is an extensive research paper as you can see because we're just going through all this right now here it is it's this paragraph right here now we read here very plainly Analysis of the data indicates a significant downregulation of about 175 maturation and regulatory genes, an upregulation of about 150 associated genes associated with growth and cellular proliferation. Now, of course, this is just this is a powerful benefit, but it's just one of the many things they discovered. Like, for example, generation of nerve cells increasing by four times the baseline is somewhere in here too. I don't know if I can find it. I could probably type in here nerve. Maybe it'll come up. And there's probably many places where it talks about it here. This may not be the place where it talks about that particularly. And I don't know if I will find it. Then That's not the main thing I'm trying to do here. Um, there's a lot on the tremendous benefits to the nerve cells and their ability to regenerate at a far more rapid rate, as well as the fact that eye-hand coordination was sickened significantly improved. So there are many results, positive results, just from being exposed to the 10 hertz frequency. In this case with NASA, I believe it was for 10 hours over 21 days, of course. This sleep machine that I'm talking about, the sleep on command machine, you put it under your pillow or your mattress and it bathes you in 
the 10 hertz frequency and actually it's designed to pull you from 14.1 hertz which makes you very alert into the um, 10 hertz or 9.6 to be accurate her frequency which is what they found when they did an experiment when Paul Becker the father of electromedicine did an experiment where he put two poles at 20 feet in length 20 feet apart and pounded them in 20 feet into the earth and then tested the waves that were coming out of the earth it was found to be 9.6 hertz on average and so that's basically 10 hertz and so the earth pulse draws you from 14.1 hertz to the 9.6 hertz frequency when it pulls you and trains your brain into sleep and then brings you back into a state of alertness from 9.6 up to the 14.1 hertz which makes you very alert so if you have it at at your computer where you're tending to fall asleep, it's going to keep you far more alert during the day. That's all I really want to share on here is just to give you the evidence of the source material so that you can go boldly go beyond where you haven't gone before and discover new realms of well-being that will open up also other new realms for you because you will live longer and have a higher quality of life when you use this and you go to my site at helpsheal.com where I have five and a half hours of high definition video in ten sections and other things you can do to significantly improve your health. This is David Thompson. Thank you for watching this video.